Hey guys, so I'm down at the river again. I don't know if you can see behind me or not. It's a beautiful day, it feels nice out here. A little bit of wind, but it's not too bad. Anyway, so what I did today was I built a crawfish trap. And uh, this is what it looks like. I just took a five gallon water jug that I had laying around my house for some reason. And I drilled a bunch of holes in it. First of all, I cut this off with a Dremel tool kind of melted the plastic a little bit and then I just drilled some holes all around the perimeter and then I tied it in there with a piece of rope and the crawfish will crawl in here I just scored this up so they could crawl in easier it'll be laying on its side like this as you can see I tied a like a piece of landscaping brick off in there that I beat up with a hammer just so it would stay nicely and as you can tell crawfish will come in this way They'll go in there, but they won't be able to get back out. So anyway, this is the food that I'll be using. This is just some bologna that I tore up and I put in a bottle that I drilled a bunch of holes in. So they'll get the smell and maybe a little taste, but they won't be able to eat it all. And this slides right into here. And it's down in there. Now I'm going to go drop it in the river. I'll show you all where I'm going to put it and then when I come get it later, see if we have any crawfish out of the Guadalupe River. All right, folks, I'm down here by the river now. I'm kind of nervous because I'm holding my iPhone in my hand. I don't want to drop it. I don't want to fall in. Anyway, I'm going to put this right here by these roots. And I'm going to tie, tie it off to one of these roots kind of down low so hopefully nobody sees it. Anyway, here it goes. Here goes nothing. Put it down here. We'll just let it sink to the bottom. Here it goes, sinking. Let it sink down there by those roots. Here it goes. Now I'm hoping it falls over sideways whenever it gets down. There it goes. It fell over. All right, now it's going all the way down. It's pretty deep here, feels like. I'm just going to let it out. I'm going to tie it down there. Anyway, I'll come get it later and see what All I right, got. I got it tied off in the water there. I had to get pretty close. I had to crawl down here on top of these here roots. Anyway, hoping to see some crawfish in my thing when I pull it out later. I'm going to wait till this evening to go in there and check it out. But anyway, now I got to crawl back up there. Climb back out of here. A lot of people like to come down here and swing off this here tree. I did that one time, threw my shoulder out real bad. I ain't gonna do that again. Anyway, hopefully we get some crawfish out of this Back here. down here at the river, I'm gonna go ahead and pull my trap out of the water. Got my friend William here on the camera. <clears throat> here it goes, here goes nothing. Got nothing. There's absolutely nothing in this trap. I guess we need to try a different spot. Yeah, nothing. Oh well, I can always try again. All right, I'm gonna try to throw this thing in one more time. And I'm gonna come back. It's about 6:30 in the evening. I'm gonna come back tomorrow morning and check it. I'm just gonna throw it in a what I think might be a shallower spot, it's a little bit less roots. I'm gonna throw it out a little bit further this time. Anyway, see, I'm just watching it chunk it out there. Then I'll tie it off and we'll check it again tomorrow. it fall over so that's good I'm just gonna tie it off to one of these roots right here and and that'll be it I'll check them tomorrow thanks <laughs>